Cycling tactic number two, the sticky bottle. When more or less the equator of the test is fulfilled, and these girls have already done more or less half of the route, generally the race begins to get a little calmer. But this is only the calm before the storm, because in a few kilometers, the real war will surely break out, which will finally give one person the victory. For this, this girl from the SD Works gets off the peloton, goes to the car, and goes in search not only of bottles, but also in search of some kind of instruction from the team manager. The director takes advantage of passing her bottles, not only for her, but often also for a teammate who needs it. Now this bottle and is usually delivered in a rather special way. Because it is not to arrive, pass it on and that's it. Basically, because the director is pushing her with the force of the car, the car is pushing the director, the director is pushing the bottle, and the bottle is pushing the cyclist. This is called sticky bottle and this type of bottling is penalized by the judges if they do it for more than 3 seconds and do not drop the bottle. Generally, these types of tactics do not have as much effect if the cyclist is going downhill or on the flat. But if you are going up a hill, or if they are going up a mountain pass, the higher the slope, the more this impulse helps, because it is totally free. And this is a help? Yes, it's a lot, but a lot a lot of help. Is this cheating? Only if you go over 3 seconds. So if you're going to hit a bottle, try not to exceed the 3 seconds required, otherwise you'll be disqualified. See you. Goodbye.